Assalamu alaikum. My name is Muhammad Fakur Alam Shojib. This is Java Tutorial 7. In this tutorial, we will learn how to measure execution time in Java. We will use system.nanotime. This is the most recommended solution to measure execution or elapsed time in Java. It provides nanoseconds level precision of execution time between two measurements. Let's start. NetBeans IDE. Long. Start time. Equal. System. Dot. Nano time. Long stop time equal system dot nano time long execution time equal you have to subtract stop time minus start time stop time minus start time stop time stop time start time start time it's total execution time in nanosecond nanosecond a c c o n d s in short from n s and print s u t to tab execution time in nanosecond cundis nanosecond and use this execution time Plus giving also NS here nanosecond now I will use a simple program which is if else statement I have already uh, discussed if else statement now I will use that same example int is equal 50 suppose if a is greater than equal 18 a so you tap print you are eligible to donate blood else SUT tab to print you are not eligible to donate blood save this program now we will check the execution time of this program run this project or press f6 so 
we have got the execution time in nanosecond is 1216100 nanosecond and you are eligible to donate blood because 50 is greater than 18 that's why this statement is printed you are eligible to donate blood therefore to measure execution time we can use system dot nano time method that's all for today if you want to learn more about java do not forget to subscribe my channel thank you very much